Hey, it's Ken Gagne with the YouTube channel GameBit. Today I'm going to show you the Mezzalo Shrine in The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild for the Nintendo Switch. It's located just southwest of the Divine Beast Varuda in Zora's region. Here it is in northeastern Hyrule, sort of central eastern actually. So there it is. And of course you meet your old falcon friend Cass who tells you to mount a creature with a crown of bone and ride it to the pedestal. Now what it is referring to is not the undead, you don't have to wait for night. What you're looking for is a deer, because those antlers are actually made of bone. That is true, not just in Hyrule, but in the world. And there are a lot of deer in this plane. Very often you'll find them drinking around this pond right here. I happen to have scared them all away. But there are other deer that you can find. And there are some right there. It helps that I am going to be wearing all my stealth gear. So I have all that equipped and it's all powered up. But I still need to be able to sneak up on them. One of them has already seen me. And those are all does. They don't have crowns of bone. So they're not going to be able to help me. These are lady deer. I need male deer. Oh dear. And there goes a restless cricket. So yeah, those deer are no good to me. I need to find their mates. So let's take a look over here in this field. I'm sure they're around here somewhere. Is that one? No, that's a lady. And right next to it is another lady. And over here is another lady. What's with all the Bambi's moms? Every time I see one, I just want to go, no! Oh, there goes one. I saw some antlers over here. Perhaps I should have been a little bit stealthier. Perhaps, well, too late now. Definitely a goat won't do. You can't ride a goat. I tried. Oh, did I see it go bounding that way? Nope. I think I'm really scaring them all away. Ah, there's one. And I only need one. So let's see if I can get the drop on them. You will need some stamina, just like when you are taming any other wild beast, be it a bear or a horse. You need to be able to ride them long enough to wear them down. Let's get over to that rock over there. I'm going to climb to the top of it. And you'll see why. Make sure my stamina replenishes. Great. This is great. Easier to sneak up on them when you're coming from above, because they never think to look up. No! Where'd it go? Ah. Oh. That's super annoying. I almost had it. I should have landed right on it. There's another one, though, right on the other side of this rock. As long as I didn't scare Doe into it just now. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, I scared away. Why is it running? Ah, uh, you know what? Oh, I can't freeze it with my stasis? That's annoying. It's a living creature. Why can't I freeze deer? There's nothing like a frozen deer. Okay, let's go after... Oh my gosh, they're all running away when I'm still a mile away. He seems to be running in circles, though. Can I get him to keep doing that while I come up to him? Yeah, there we go. Soothe, soothe. There we go. Now I can ride you. If I get off him, he will immediately just disappear. As if you were riding any other wild creature that's not a horse. But for now, he is mine, all mine. Look at me holding on to his little tuft. I can even kick him up and ride him hard. All right. Now if I can just remember where Cass is, I think if I just listen for the sound of the accordion, maybe I will remember where he is. There he is. All right. So kick him one more time. Oh, no. Soothe him. Soothe him. Soothe. Soothe. There we go. I'll, can I talk to you while I'm riding this thing? Doesn't matter. But that was it. That is the fun little side quest to activate that shrine. It is a shrine quest all about riding deer. I don't know why the shrine would be triggered by that. I don't know why that is the activation key. Seems pretty odd. But there it is. Let me talk to you. I get it now. The crown of bone refers to antlers. Of course, that's a mountain buck. Those majestic creatures are a bit like the kings of the forest, aren't they? <laughs> it's a crown. I get it. Your exploits here could be their own heroic song, you know. Take care. I may the light illuminate your path. 
So that was, which shrine quest was that? The Crowned Beast. A beast that wears a crown of bone, prancing through the lush green. Mount the beast upon his throne, for only then the shrine is seen. Now is it... I guess they're not technically deer if they're male, right? They're bucks. So I was using the wrong word. Please don't leave a comment in the YouTube video to let me know how wrong I was. Okay. Mezzalo! Now, can I get off this guy and immediately kill him? That would have been just as Zerx. I waste no part of the deer. I ride him to the shrine and I eat his meat. But he escaped. He escaped. So he gets to live. Silly deer. Silly buck. That's right. Alright, let's go in this place and find out what was so endearing about this shrine. Dow. Oh. Well, it's not a blessing shrine, so getting here wasn't half the fun, or all the fun. Wow, this place looks spacious. Cavernous, even. To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am Mezalo. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. What trial? Ancient Trifecta. The Triforce? Probably not. Okay, so I see a switch. I see a metal block that I can magnesis. A treasure chest. Great. I see a pedestal, or a button. I see a laser. And I see no way to get to any of those places over there. But I bet I can make that change. Let's see if I move this out of the way. Actually, let's just start off by hitting this once and seeing what happens. Okay, so that moved. Good. So I can just move this out of the way, right? And now it hits this, the switch, but just once. What good does that do me? I need it to be constantly changing the switch so that this thing is continuously rotating while I'm going around. I guess I could do that. Whoops. Did I just hit it twice? It doesn't matter, apparently. Then I can just do that. Oh god. I'm taking it with me, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure this is such a good idea, but okay. Let's find out what's inside the chest. What's inside the box? A thunder blade. And of course, I have no room to carry it, because I have all these Korok seeds I'm carrying around waiting to be cashed in. I don't really need two magma rods, do I? I'm just going to go ahead and drop one of those right here. I can find another one whenever I need it, I guess, because I have photos of the rod and the enemy that carries it. The Meteo Wizrobe. Okay, so how do I... I can't put this all the way back over there. And why is that thing on a ramp? What is the point of that? Great. That's just great. That makes everything worse. Because now I can't even see the switch to shoot it with an arrow. My goodness. Okay. So let's just do that a few more times, I guess. And it just keeps rotating. Great. I need to bring this block with me, don't I? That's what I need to put on that switch over there, isn't it? Oh, I think I see what I need to do. I need to put the that on the moving platform. Oh, that doesn't make any sense. Because I can just do this, can't I? I don't need to be up there. It doesn't need to be up there. I can just put it there. Oh, crap. Nope. I, ca I got this. I got it. I got it. There we go. Up. Up. Wow, it seems stuck. There we go. Why is it... Oh, God. Where is it now? I'm trying to get it onto the switch, but the angle is very odd. There. Okay. There is no... Doo -doo 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 -doo. I thought there would be. That's the only thing I can see that would hold the switch down, so I guess that's where it has to go, right? It'd be... Why can't I get over there? That would be helpful. I'm pretty sure I could just pick up the laser then. 
And there's no way I can float over there. That I don't have enough of a height to make that jump. Okay, but now I'm here. So let's use a bomb this time. Whoop. That's not gonna work. Although it does give me an idea. Although will setting off a round bomb near a square bomb cause them both to explode? Probably. Yep. yep. Great. So I could shoot it with my arrow from here if I m must. Could probably even use my meteor rod. Let's just do... Oh wait, but I need to be on it when it goes off. There we go. Great. But there's no way I can hit it again from here. Okay, so I should have left a bomb on it is what I need to do. I don't know how that will work. Oh, arrow. Mew. Once more, dear friends, into the breach. And then let's leave a bomb here. Not a round one. Let's use a square one. Oh, God. Ha! Not quite what I intended. Now I gotta bring it all the way back around. Wow, Link is ready to go to town against this crystal. He is not gonna take any guff. This is going to be a battle to the death. Can't quite hit it from here. Not even if I jump, I think. Hmm. Can't shoot the laser, can I? Whoa! Why did that work? That was weird. Okay. Now I just gotta blow up the bomb. And that's it. Ah! There's the tone I was waiting for. Did I miss any chests hiding in the corner over there? Doesn't look like it. So I guess that's it. That is this weird deer shrine. Bing! Bush! Now what? Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. Mmm, I love hero sandwiches. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. You just said you were going to give me a hero. I could go for a submarine sandwich. Come on. That is not a submarine. I'm so disappointed right now. But I will take it because that's my 52nd spirit orb, and I can go redeem that for something valuable. Spirit orb, a symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. Weak. May the goddess smile upon you. Ooh, you look like you're about to Hadoken me. Please don't. But I hope you, dear viewer, stay tuned to YouTube channel Gambits for more Zelda shrines. Oh dear.